kidneys. How can you kidneys? I don't like the colour. Of your kidneys. Hello? Exit the box and surrender to the glory of the Sontaran Empire. Shush. Well, of course I keep passing out. There's all these bits. Why do you keep talking like that? What's gone wrong with your accent? Why do you... There's nothing wrong with her accent. You sound the same. It's spreading. You all sound all... English. Now, you've all developed a fault. The question is how. The flesh itself has been combusted. No, no, shut up. You don't have a brains, pudding. Look at you. I kind of made a decent species. Planet of the pudding brains. Look at the eyebrows. These are attack eyebrows. You can take bottle tops off with these. <laughs> they are mighty eyebrows indeed, sir. They're cross. <laughs> They're crosser than the rest of my face. They're independently cross. <laughs> they probably want to seed from the rest of my face and set up their own independent state of eyebrows. That's Scott. I am Scottish, haven't I? I've gone Scottish. Oh, yes, you are. You are definitely Scots, sir. Oh, you might shoot me. Then where will you be? In charge of your vessel. You'd starve to death. Trying to find the light switch. Who are you? I'm Lieutenant Journey Blue of the Combined Galactic Resistance. I demand you take me back to my command ship, the Aristotle, which is currently located. No, hey, not like that. I think he's probably her uncle, but I may made that up to pass the time while they were talking. This is Clara, not my assistant. She's uh, some other world. I'm his carer. Yeah, my carer. She cares, so I don't have to. Well, I don't need armed babysitters. We're not babysitters. We're here to shoot you dead if you turn out to be a Dalek spy. Well, that's a relief. I hate babysitters. Why? Never microwave the lasagna without pricking the foam on top. It explodes. Don't be lasagna. Because I am the Doctor. And this is my spoon. On the... What say you, lads? Ah! Yeah! <laughs> Stop <laughs> laughing. Why are you always doing that? Are you all simple or something? <laughs> Right! That isn't even funny. That was bantering. I am totally against bantering. God! 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 Oh, you two, God! Shut up! Do either of you understand in any way at all that there isn't actually a God out there? Gone. Gone. He took my bedspread. Oh, the human race. You're never happy, are you? She's doing the all eyes things because her face is so white. She needs three mirrors. Shut up. Everybody. Just, just shut up. And what is this display now as amusing as you shut are? Shut up. Just shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut it up, up, up. You're weird. Yes, I am. What about you? I'm a disruptive influence. Good to meet you. And you. Now, get lost. OK. Really brilliant reasoning. How can you think that I'm her dad when we both look exactly the same age? We do not look the same age. I was being kind. Right, I'm going to hypnotise her. Clara, go. On my way. Are you using her like a decoy? No, not like a decoy. As a decoy. Don't they teach you anything at stupid school? Brooke, well, is there anything I can do? Yes, yes, and this is very, very important. Leave us alone. Skip over. I've got stuff to clean up with. What? And I've got these from the chemist. Vortex manipulators. Travel sickness. Good. Because I don't like people being sick in my TARDIS. <laughs> no being sick, no hanky-panky. Bristol. Doctor, we're in Bristol. And 120 miles from where we should be. Impressive. No, not impressive. Annoying. No, this is impressive. This is annoying. I'm the doctor. Don't you dare. Doctor Oswald. <clears throat> you can call me Clara. I'm Rigsy. So, uh... What are you a doctor of? Of lies. Well, I'm usually quite vague about that. I think I just picked the title because it makes me sound important. My doctor knows what you are hilarious. Can we get back to work, do you think? It's, it's bigger on the inside. You know, I don't think that statement's ever been truer. It's bigger on the inside than the outside. Oh, did you not notice? I just thought it was supposed to be bigger on the inside, so I didn't say anything. Well, of course it's supposed to be bigger. I must be a confused by that. Miss Oswald, dark hair. Highly unpredictable. Surprisingly round face. Everyone says she's in love with Mr. Pink. The PE teacher. Maths, I really like him. I was in his group. Mr. Pink was looking at you. Well, that explains why you're lost. Hey, do not touch anything. 
Anything. Okay? Okay. See? Someone needs to go. Child protection. I hope I'm right. It'd be slightly awkward if the world was destroyed at this point. What? And that won't do. What won't? You won't. Look at you. I need skeptical. Clever, critical, I don't need more people. Put years on your face. And what do people see us together? It looks like you've been melted. If you'd rather not hear these words, there's still... Can you just hurry up, please, or I'll hit you with my shoe. No, 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 no. Lying in the sand. Santa Claus does not do the scientific explanation. All right. As the doctor might say, Oh, it's all a bit dreamy wimmy. Why don't you just go in and make up a naughty list? I have, mate, and you're on it. Don't give me that look. You're supposed to be warm and friendly and cheerful. Oh, yeah. Well, look at your great bedside manner. Don't be so hostile. Oh. Doctor, behave. You want to know how dangerous I am? Davros sent you. You know how stupid you are? <laughs> you came. <sighs> Is that supposed to frighten me? Because the real question is, where did I get the cup of tea? Answer, I'm the doctor. Just accept it. I am dying, doctor. You keep saying that, you keep not dying. Can you give it some welly? Come on. It's not them that lose a bonus. It's OK, I understand. You're an idiot. Isn't it? Take away your weapons and you're not so scary, are you? Morning. What happened? The Big Bang, dinosaurs, bipeds, and mounting sense of futility. More recently. No brain out with a bullet, dandy prat. This is banter. I'm against banter. I'm on record on the subject of banter. Look, I admire you, okay? I think you're ingenious. Pretending to be a couple of seven-year-olds is a splendid way to conceal your blobbiness. But let's not pretend. You're very blobby. Oh, hello. Any questions? Why do you have a Union Jack parachute? Um, camouflage. Camouflage? Yes, we're in Britain. So what happened? From the beginning of time, that's a very long story. Doctor. Well... <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Not for that. I'm good cop, you're bad cop. No, 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 we don't have to... Can I not be the good cop? Doctor, we've discussed this. Your face. Oh, yeah. Well, you gardeners. I hate gardening. What sort of a person has a power complex about flowers? It's dictatorship for inadequates. Or to put it another way, it's dictatorship. You will bow. Oh, no, I'm sorry, Your Majesty. I can't do that. You what? It's my back. Your back? Yeah, my back's playing up. It simply refuses to carry the weight of an entirely pointless stratum of society who contribute nothing of worth to the world and crush the hopes and dreams of working people. Garbage disposal, right? You're ready to say, we Put me down! You're not supposed to be in here. I know, it's terrible. Sorry, I'm doing everything I can to stop me. So, Doctor, you think this is over? Yeah. <laughs> your bomb's gone, your plan's finished. And look, there's unit on the way to close your head office. You're thinking? Tell me what you're thinking about. A magic haddock. Obviously. I can hear you breathing. Why are you Scottish? It's Scottish, I'm just cross. Is there Scotland in space? They're all over the place, demanding independence from every planet of the land. It could send ripples through time that mean that I'm not even born in the first place and I could just disappear. Definitely. I mean, that's what happened to Pete. Pete? Your friend, Pete. He's standing there a moment ago, but he stepped on a butterfly. Now you don't even remember him. Shut up. Oh, I'm being serious. Yeah, so is Pete. Yeah, I'm a bit of a thief myself. You know, I bet you that I could steal anything from your shop. Get out! Oh. In theory, I could steal anything. In theory. Oh, he's my granddad. Oh, come on. Father, at least, please. All right, grandfather. Well, what do you think I'm doing? Electrolysis, splitting water into hydrogen and oxygen. Oh, that's clever. I wish I could see me doing that. These locks is out of the subroutine. Oh, I'm sorry, I just thought I was tweeting. They're through the third lock. Open the doors. Are you out of your mind? Ah, uh, yes, completely, but that's not a recent thing. The UN called. They want you in Termezistan immediately. Tell them no. Oh, 
they wouldn't take no for an answer. You, appalling here. This thing that we're sitting on, what is it? Uh, we thought they were just, like, filming something here or something. Thank you. Very helpful. Now go away or something. According to this, you've been on board Friday's ship the whole time. Yes, that we were... That was... That sounds... That sounds... Convincing. Quite, that's, that sounds... Yes, it's right. On his ship. Shh. Did anybody hear that? Do you know what that sound was? What? That was the sound of my patience shattering into a billion little pieces. Now, you'll have a choice. You can carry on slaughtering each other till no one is left standing. Are you glue the hell up? Stop mucking about and concentrate. Now, Dole, do something non irritate On it, sir. Time lords are friends with each other, dear. Everything else is cradle snatching. Oh, I... Sorry. Press for time. That was good. Venusian Aikido. I thought you needed four arms for Venusian. I've got hidden talents, as well as hidden arms. I thought... Well, well, I uh, assumed that I'd get... Uh, younger. I am younger! I know what you're thinking. Where is he? Hello, sir. When you're already dying, you're entitled to think that your day couldn't get any worse, but here you are. And both of you are here. How does that work? We can be everyone. Hmm. We are everyone. <laughs> yeah, it's good, this, isn't it? Now I'm all made of glass, not just my nipples. Yeah, though they got my hair a bit wrong, though, didn't they? You don't have any hair. I have invisible hair. <laughs>